so mind-blowing to see how many disasters, Ryan, that the Red Cross has responded to this year, from hurricanes <laughs> to wildfires and all in the midst of the pandemic. Well, here's a look back, just a snapshot of the hard work of Red Cross volunteers. This year of 2020 had so many hurricanes and so many wildfires and people are in need. This year, we've obviously seen um, an unprecedented number and record-breaking number of disasters across the country. Hurricane Hannah hits Texas July 25th. Days later, Hurricane Isis makes landfall in North Carolina August 2nd. Hurricane Laura hit Louisiana August 27th. Hurricane Sally making landfall in Alabama September 16th. Meanwhile, one after another, major wildfires exploded across California, Oregon, and Washington. Then October 9th, Hurricane Delta hit, and Hurricane Zeta on October 28th. And that's just some of the national disasters the Red Cross has responded to this year. We've deployed this year more than 7,000 volunteers to the many disasters that occurred this year. Volunteers have gone to help. We even deployed 150 locally from the Chicagoland and Illinois area People are answering the call. Across the country and here at home, volunteers serve more than 2.7 million meals and snacks. The Red Cross also provided close to 11,000 households with emergency financial assistance. And this year alone, just in 2020, the Red Cross has provided nearly 1.2 million overnight stays in shelters and hotels. And that type of service just would not be possible without thousands of Red Cross volunteers. And locally, those Red Cross volunteers have helped at more than 1,000 home fires in the Chicago region and Northern Illinois. Not to mention, responding after the derecho in the Midwest after the storm whipped up nearly a dozen tornadoes, including in Rogers Park, and knocked out power to more than 850,000 families in the Chicago area.